hunting party down here. No, call them aside. God damn it! Help! Oh!
got nothing to do with it. It's good to see you two go. Oh, sorry, they did a real number on your leg. Oh, no, it looks worse than it is. Uh, have you heard from any of the others? Nothing. Wait, what are you doing? The wolves took my food back. The transmitter from the lifeboat's in it. If we don't get that back, we're not getting off this bloody island. But you need, you need bandages, morphine, antiseptic. They're also in the park. Shit. Exactly. Come here. Come on. Oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. 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 Oh, don't do this to me, you northern bastard. US Marine. Were they on the island in force or just an advance party? I was at last granted an audience with Her Majesty, Himiko of Yamatai. I must confess, she is unlike any woman I have ever encountered. Beautiful, yet inscrutable, calculating even. She surrounds herself with her priestesses of the sun. No men attend her, save the general of her armies. When I met with her alone, I came to realize that she is not at all what she seems. I was sent by my lord to spy on her, to assess the strength of her armies. But now, I feel she is the one assessing me. My lord has perhaps underestimated the threat of Yamatai. Though I cannot gauge the true strength of her storm god, I cannot deny a powerful feeling that the Sun Queen should not be trifled with.
just want the pack. That's all. to get this back to Roth. young lady like you learn to do a thing like that? <laughs> Late shift at the Nine Bells. <sighs> Wolf's got nothing on a broken bottle. Hey, you got it. Nice work. So I assume the plan is to take that up to the radio tower. Well, it should give us the best shot of broadcasting a strong signal in every direction. Send out that SOS. And I'm not climbing anytime soon. Yeah, I was afraid you were going to say that. You can do it, Laura. After all, you're a croft. I don't think I'm that kind of croft. Sure you are. You just don't know it yet. Well, that's happened my fast letter then. Just be careful, Laura.
Telling you, Reyes, it's a mechanical, not an electrical problem. Now, Alex.
Uh, this looks like it might be an electrical problem. You think? <laughs> oh, hello. Hey. Is this little fox, oh, huh? Yeah, she's cute, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's Alicia. Alicia. It's my like daughter. That. Oh. 14 years old and smarter than you'll ever be. She must must get that from her father. Don't give him the attention. And yeah. I'll take a look at this. Probably electrical. From her father. So I was on the walk, right? Doing a spot of midnight fishing. Hey, Grim, time to button down the hatches. I be right with you. So I was on the lock, right? And this thing comes looming at me, looming out of the water it was. So I give it a old Glasgow kiss, you know. <laughs> Get shot of trouble nine times out of ten, that does. Took me a week to sleep that night off, and I've not touched a drop since. See you at dinner, Sam. <laughs> Yeah. All right, can we take B-roll, please? Thank you. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take three, and action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like this. Yeah, you got... Good Lord, cut! 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 Is, is he coming back? Dr. James? <sighs> I'll go get him. World-renowned archaeologist. I discovered... The world-renowned archaeologist, Mr. Dr. I don't James Whitman. Of fish. It's just a fish. It's fine. Oh, it's just You're a gonna fish. be fine. This damned reality TV business. I'm, I'm meant to be bringing culture to the people, Sam. Not dinner. Uh, no offense, Jonah. The audience demands content, Dr. Whitman. You know that. So until we find the Lost Kingdom, we need footage like this. Come on, let's just take it from the top, okay? We're gonna make you look like Gordon Ramsay in editing. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take four, action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like that. I've studied them so much, I can see charts on the back of my eyelids. But if I'm not right about Yamatai being in the Dragon's Triangle... I remember when you found that one of your father's digs. You ran up and showed it to me dressed in your penguin pajamas. <laughs> I was five <laughs> years old, it was my first find. Yeah. You've got great instincts, girl. You just have to trust them. Mm. That's what my father used to say. Now, there was a man that ran on instinct. For better or worse. He would have been so proud of you, Lara. We're getting closer to the storm. Well, whatever's coming, we'll get through it, eh? <laughs> What do they want? 